Greetings Agile users. In today's video, we will cover three popular prioritization techniques for effective product development. But first, let's see what prioritization actually means. It relates to the method that helps teams identify which feature or project needs to be prioritized above others. In other words, prioritization allows you and your team to focus on and invest in the most valuable work that aligns with your business goals. Now then, with the prioritization definition out of the way, we will take a look at three popular techniques that you must try in product development, which are Rice Framework, the Moscow Method, and finally, the Value versus Effort Matrix. First, let's talk about the RICE Prioritization Framework. RICE stands for Reach, Impact, Confidence and Effort. This prioritization framework, or scoring system, lets product teams focus and work on initiatives likely to impact their given goal the most. With this prioritization technique, product teams can make more informed and balanced decisions. They will take into account the potential benefits and the level of uncertainty and amount of work needed. However, the RICE scoring does not take dependencies into account. There will be times when a high initiative gets deprioritized over something else. These estimations in the framework cannot be 100% accurate. In an agile environment, things can change very quickly, leading to evolving priorities in the long run. Next, we will move on to the Moscow Prioritization Method. Moscow stands for Must Have, Should Have, Could Have and Won't Have. And it helps product development teams define the importance of each feature or requirement, which allows for better decision making and allocating resources. The Moscow Method helps teams prioritize a large number of requirements. Moreover, it enables project stakeholders to have clear conversations about what needs to be completed now and what can be done later. But teams and stakeholders can get too excited and overestimate the number of must-have features. This method is more for formulating releases than the prioritization itself. Last but not least, we will see how the value versus effort matrix holds up in this list. The value versus effort matrix is a simple approach among prioritization techniques and it involves taking your features and initiatives and quantifying them by using value and effort scores. In other words, this method helps teams focus on tasks that bring the greatest return on investment. This prioritization technique provides room for effective discussions among stakeholders on what value and effort truly mean. It also helps product managers discover strategic alignment holes and fix them. However, this model requires some qualitative judgment and estimation to assess the two metrics. And if you want to utilize these techniques in your JIRA work, then RootMap is just what you need. This road mapping solution empowers you to make task prioritization using rice, value versus effort, and even custom methods of your own. You can also leverage its prioritization table and matrix to get a bigger picture of your project as a whole and then make better and data-driven decisions, all in the same dashboard. Thank you for staying with us until the end. If you want to know more details about these prioritization techniques, you can read our blog article in the pinned comments section. And don't forget to try out RootMap, a solution to all your planning needs. Be agile, be productive.